All right, so what we're doing is we are making a Mickey Mouse centerpiece with styrofoam. So what we did was we went to Hobby Lobby and bought this um, half dome and then two medium-sized balls, and we're gluing them to the dome, and we use some skewers to attach the little balls to the dome. And then we're going to take some of these Dum Dum lollipops, and we're going to basically put them inside of the styrofoam and cover it completely. So. Right now we're just kind of gluing them just to kind of reinforce the balls so that they don't fall with the weight of the lollipops. Okay, so now we are adding the lollipops and I'll get a little closer so you can see what he's doing. And then, as you can see, you're going to just basically start pushing them through the styrofoam and covering all of the white with the lollipops. And you can just do the order and colors, whatever you want really. Um, just to kind of cover it up and be festive. Okay, so this is basically like a progress check so you guys can see how it starts to come together once you start adding your lollipops. So um, what you want to do is you want to make sure that you kind of get as close to each other as possible so that you don't have any gaps. Um, and then that will make it look nice and full. So this is what it looks like from the top. So we're going to keep filling and what we've done is we've rearrange some of the colors so that they're not a bunch of the same colors in the same area okay so now we are working on the ears so for these you have to cut the little sticks a little bit shorter so it's gonna show you about how much to cut I don't know if you were able to see that but we'll show you another one it's so probably about let's see about that much off so pretty much where the wrapper part of it ends, you cut right there, and that should be enough to actually stick it into the ears. Um, and this foam is a lot better than the one we use as a dome. We can only find like a smooth styrofoam, which when you push it in, it makes a hole even bigger. Where these ones, it's more of a textured styrofoam material, so it actually sticks better, and it's you don't have to worry about them coming out. But these are a little bit kind of loose, but. If you pack them really nicely, it should be okay. Okay, so this is the completed Mickey head with all of the Dum Dum lollipops. So let me get a little closer so you can see. And let me show you the back. Now we did have to add um, a lot of skewers from the underneath part um, to hold up the, the little balls up here because these are actually really heavy after all the lollipops are in there, but that's what it looks like. Okay, so I wanted to share with you how I'm going to put together the favors. I'm just going to show you how I do one of them. Um, so I got these little Mickey cups. I'm sorry for the glare. My blinds are open. But um, I got these Mickey cups. They were 99 cents at um, Party City. So every kid that's coming is getting one of these. And you can actually use it to drink out of. So I figured that would be better than a plastic bag. And it has a little spot where you, they can use it while they're here to put their name on it. Or you could just use your regular um, themed um, disposable party cups. Um, so I got these. I got Mickey pencils um, because they all like to write so I figured that would be a nice add. Um, I got Mickey keychains for boys and then I got mini keychains for girls um, just because I don't know I just thought that it would be cute to kind of personalize it and make it kind of pink for a little girl's um, little favor. Um, my best friend's daughter is going to be one of the ones that are coming, so I got her this cute little Minnie Mouse eraser. And all of this is from Party City. They're probably like a couple couple cents each thing. They're not that expensive. And then I got some bubbles. Like, I got hers in pink with Mickey on it. And then I got for the boys, they had them in blue and yellow. And then um, for candy, I just bought this party mix. Um, it's the kitty mix from Walmart. A Last night, actually. So I'm going to open this up a little bit here to grab some candy. And so what I want to do is put a couple things. See, they have, like, these little gummy worms. Those are kind of cool. So I just kind of want to put them in there. And I want to put the pencil down so that it sits there kind of nicely. And then to kind of surround the pencil with the candy. And so you want to add a couple different mixes. Like, and just kind of nicely arrange them and then for like the boys you want to take 
if you're doing bubbles, for example, I'm going to put these down at the bottom, kind of like that. And then I'm going to put the keychain in there. And then now you can just kind of fill it with little bits of candy and things like that. So I'm going to put that in there and just fill it up with candy. I know kids love candy, um, so I think this is, a, this is a good mix. And then, oh, there's like um, little blow pops. You can stick a couple in there. Smarties, who doesn't love Smarties, right? Stick those in there. Let's see what else do I have here. Ooh, I love these. These are the Warheads. Do you guys like these? These are amazing. And it's so hard for me to keep a straight face with these on. Easy. Um, I think that's it. I think I got one of everything. So yeah, let's put a couple more um, Nowelators in there. And see, there you go. And then that's all you have to do. And this is... Better, I think, because kids obviously like candy, and there's not a bunch of plastic junk toys that are just going to get thrown away, because honestly, um, if I was a parent with all these junk toys, I would probably throw it away. I know that sounds kind of bad, but um, a lot of those pieces, they kind of break apart, so I figured this would be a little bit better. They can reuse a pencil for school. They can reuse a cup at home with, you know, for anything. So that's kind of the favor, so I'm going to put together the rest of them, and that's going to be it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video, and I... And so I just wanted to share with you a quick alternative. If you don't want to do the favors like I did before with all those little bits and pieces, all those cool little gadgets and cups, the easiest thing if you're having a lot of kids, um, I know it can add up if you have like 10 or 15 kids or more than that coming. So the easiest thing for you to do if you want to kind of save money and if you're on a budget uh, is to get these little um, treat bags that I got. This is the, the wrapper on it, but they're $1.99 for 50 of these. And they're tiny little um, small cellophane bags. And what you can do is um, fill it up with candy. And you could just kind of place the candy nicely in there so that you can kind of see, or the kids can kind of see everything they're getting in there. And then you can just throw a couple pieces in there like this. Let's get some, oh, here we go, some Smarties out of the same mix. And a couple of these Warheads. It's so yummy. And then what you can do is kind of tie it. I got these little uh, rolls of ribbon. These were 99 cents for six feet of ribbon, so I have one undone here. And what you can do is take a little bit of ribbon and tie it around the little treat bag like this. And you could do like a little bow or you could do a little knot, whatever you want. Um, and you can just, you know, do something simple like that.
so this is what the favor looks like once it's completed. Um, we, what we did was we put three of them in a bag, a cellophane bag with the ribbons, the same ones that I use for the candy bags. And that's going to be a thank you to everybody for coming. If you hear any noise, that's my husband in the backyard um, doing some setup stuff. So here we have the Mickey ears with the lollipop, and here is his Mickey cake. Let me zoom in. Hopefully, you guys are going to be able to see it. If not, I'll insert some pictures. But there it is. There is his cake. This is the Mickey ears, and then we have on this side. Zoom in for you. A clear plastic bowl with um, white, pearl white and red gumballs with a matching scoop so that the kids can eat. There are all of the um, candy bags I put together. Here are some Mickey ears. Then these little noisemakers there. And here, a couple more Mickeys. And then, let me zoom out, more plates. They all have the Mickey design, the plates, and the spoons, but that's pretty much it. And then we have the banner. It says, happy birthday with the lighting. You're not going to be able to see it. And then we have like these little um, things hanging randomly around the house, and then a couple around the um, light fixtures. So that's basically the setup for the birthday boy. And let me zoom out for you guys so you guys can see. And there it is.